hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video guys on today's video i'm going to repeat the previous video also if you already watched my previous video and understand them just go ahead and skip i'm remaking this video because the previous video is not that very clear so guys on today's video i'm going to teach you guys how to transfer data from your device to a different device now i have this samsung s9 plus on my right hand and then samsung a72 on my left hand so let's assume the samsung a72 is the new phone and the old phone is samsung s9 plus so in order for you to transfer data from one device to another go ahead and download this application called the zender so um i already have it open right here go ahead and type in zender on your um android play store to search for the application and if you've discovered it go ahead and click on install but if you already have it installed just go ahead and click on open to open it on both end so on this end on the samsung s9 since we are going to be moving um things from data from this device to the next device all we need to do is to tap on this button on the bottom area that has this um this x icon like the s icon that has a forward in front of them go ahead and tap it and click on send and then on the other device you need to tap in receive you need to tap on receive on the um on the samsung on the samsung sm a72 and you notice all of the device that is actually connected or located within your range within your range with display so go ahead and tap on the exact one you can notice um the android share let me go ahead and go back on this device so that you see what i just tapped on now you notice it says android share 9481 the same with the one displaying on the samsung s7 and um, on the samsung s9 plus so go ahead and tap on that particular option and it's going to give you this um it's going to give you an option to scan the qr code so go ahead and hover it over the samsung s9 plus so when you hover it it will start connecting to the device so it's going to display this option that says zender wants to um use temporal wi-fi network to connect to your device so go ahead and click on connect to connect that particular device wait for it to load up and just now it has said connection successful so now they are connected to each other so now let's assume i want to send in this um application displaying right here on the top menu it actually displays applications so if you want to send in application go ahead and select all of the application that you want to send and then go ahead and hit send and it will be transferred to the device you want to know what is tra being transferred you can tap on this area to see you notice it's being transferred now you notice what is being sent right this is being received and if i tap on this area you can notice what is being received and if you see sent nothing is being sent now this is what it received and this is what i sent now let me go ahead and tag this menu icon on the top area to um collapse that particular option now on this top area you can notice there are several things there um the first one is actually the history of what you just did previously the history will show you everything you just sent so far and i just tapped on cancel and the next one we actually show you what you just downloaded from that particular application if you tap on each of them you see there is no new downloads now the next area is actually um the drum um the android icon which actually displays all of the applications that are inbuilt on the device that are already installed on the device you can see this is every application i have on my device and then the next one is actually the image area which shows all of the image that you have on your device so if you want to transfer images you can notice all of your image will be displayed right here so you can easily tap on them to select select um just make sure you tap on this circle in front of the images to perfectly select them so that it won't display the preview of the image once you tap them you can notice the send on the bottom area so you can go ahead and send it so um this is everything that i have on my device and this is the total of the things i have so now if i swipe right you can see all of the music on my device also and the next one is actually the media and the third one is um actually the gif i don't have anything on the gif and now guys if you are trying to send 
a PDF or a document, you can find everything right here. You notice right here, it says document zero ebook. I have 23 ebook. I can tap on it to see all of the ebooks I have. There are a lot of tests there, but there is no PDF. So if you have any PDF, it will be displayed right there. So now if you have probably an application or a zip file that you want to transfer, all you need to do is to tap on the phone and you can see all of the zip file or everything you have right there that you want to transfer and also guys you can also notice that there are folders right there so if you have what you want to send on the folders you can go ahead and select the exact folder that is leading to that particular area and then transfer it to anybody or to any device so this is all i want to show you guys on how to transfer your data from one device to the next so if you have any question regarding this video please leave that on, on the comment section but if you are satisfied with this video smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video and i'm going to see you guys on my next video stay safe and peace